Ridley. The baby, Ridley. The baby. Age her up. Oh god, we're waiting for her to climb the stairs so we could take her back down. This is one of the reasons why I hate stairs in houses for sins. Time to age up another baby. Glad you like it. A break? <laughs> there you go. Alright, let's get back on track. What are you doing? Put her down, let her age up. No, 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 no cake, no cake, no cake. You're so uh, you're fauna? Uh-huh. They're gonna eat the cake, aren't they? Hey, 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 my friends. It's me, the veteran mom of Kenzie, and I am working on my Sims 100 baby challenge. And Ridley just had baby number 44. She just got pregnant with baby number 45, but she also just lost her all-time favorite baby, Jordan, who lived with her in the house the longest and was also her best friend. And I'm hoping that she will hit baby 50 before she ages up to adulthood, which means she's still on track to finish this whole 100 baby challenge herself. Let's see if she can get there. First off, Samantha aged up. Let's see what she looks like. Oh, I know, you're so upset. I am so sorry. Ridley, just do what I say and everything will be good. No, no, no. Oh, I forgot about that. Okay. I really want Donna. Let's see. Donna, I really want you to ignore the babies. Go upstairs. Try it out and sleep. Elliot, same with you. Put everything down. Oh, you still didn't bathe? Are you kidding me? Take a shower. Cry it out and sleep. Ridley, you tend to the baby. Foster gets food. Foster, Foster, you were so hungry. Now you need to cook. You need to catch up on some cooking. Where are you going with that food? They're gonna take you away by the time you get- Why couldn't you just sit at the nearest chair or on the floor? Did you eat fun? What are you still up for? Oh my god, dude. It is 5 a.m. now. You still haven't done the things I've asked. I've got other people to tend to. I can't follow you around. After I queue you up, you should be doing the stuff I asked you to do. It is love day. Ridley needs to go meet somebody. Oh, I forgot. She didn't have... They didn't have likes. Okay, let's see what she likes. Watch. Some of the things she has to do every day, she's going to positively hate. I'm going to have to make her do them anyway. Why do Sims look so maniacal when they're making a salad? Samantha is sleeping. She needs to get one of her skills up to level 4, so I guess we'll do motor. She's a C student, so we gotta get her doing her homework. Why are you guys still home? You have school! I hope their moods don't affect their school day. They're so close to aging up and I really need them to. And you've already achieved your potty level 3, okay. So basically, Forrest just has to work on that. Thinking skill. Foster has to work on imagination, movement, and potty. And he's just about there on the other two. Okay, I'm walking around going, what's that? What's that? Yes, thank you for cleaning. She's actually doing her job today. That's right, she was trying to be a celebrity. What star celebrity is she? She is a B-lister, but you know what? She's gonna lose her status if she don't do something soon, I'll bet. Oh yeah, we'll put out a video. I wonder if she has any. Hey, we do. She should put a couple out. Malachi is calling, wants to go on a date. No thanks, sweetie. I'm done with you. I know that sounds harsh, but that's just the way it is. Okay, they're home? Oh, hallelujah. Grades are up. Yay. You were stopping by for a bit of aspiration and you want to ruminate? Okay. Invite him into brainstorm. Oh, look! Danny's here! <laughs> Invite her into. <laughs> there you go. Did you- you still- okay. You see why you're still tired? Cause you went and napped in the hot tub instead of going to bed like I told you.
You guys are aging up, so I really don't care. But you're just so annoying. Our interest from investing is $62,000 a week? Girl! I don't know where she got this financial wizardry that she has, but jeez. Yeah, she, she's never gonna have to work another day in her life. Can we actually get a picture now? Okay. Patrick. And now Elliot can age up and Donna can age up. Somehow Donna caught up ages for Elliot. I think it was in grade school, She because she's a fast learner. Okay. Tiki's coming! I would rather do it without the glasses on. Do we ask him to change his outfit? Oh! Elliot aged up. Okay! So his trait is... He's lactose intolerant. You know, that is such a jip of a trait. Seriously, when you think of people's traits, do you think about them being lactose intolerant? I... Having to avoid dairy just doesn't strike me as a fair and valid trait. And now, you can age up. Wait, age up first. Let's try to get Patrick in a new outfit. Okay, we got him in a new outfit. Let's see if we can get the picture now. No, please don't sit down to chat. Okay, wait, no. Patrick, do you have a normal freaking outfit? Without some weird stuff on your head? All right, I got Donna aging up. She's so pretty. Okay. While we're all standing around waiting, Elliot. Oh, there it is. Okay. Her trait is squeamish. But we have two more adults in the house, and this is good. Okay. Did you get your son to change? Okay, yay. All right. Now let's see if we can get a picture. Yes. Very nice. We finally got it. All right. Let's see what... Chill out, see what the baby wants, and then you can go to sleep. It's like her work is never done, but since everything takes like 10 times longer than it should, that's part of the reason why. Yo, zip. Very proud of yourself. Yes, you're a gorgeous adult, and you can help clean the house. Samantha needs to get skill up, and she needs to do her work. So eat something, and then we did. Samantha with the blue streaks in her hair at such a young age. <laughs> She's a rebel, a wild child. She already did her homework. You are awesome. Go play some monkey bars. You lurvy the new boo. Okay, let's age him up. There you go. He's an angelic little one. <laughs> Another blonde. So many blondes. <laughs> what? Oh, I hate this pirate update then. Okay, shut off talk like a pirate. I don't understand anything. Oh, boy, matey. What does that got to do with anything? Really? You can carry him down there. You're still not eating salad when you get there. And you are definitely not throwing paint around. Can you not put him down? Is that why you're having trouble? Okay. <laughs> Friendly introduction? He's your son! Why does she have to introduce- well, This is a new glitch? Why is she having to introduce herself to her son? Dude! Uh, no! Eat! Why are you putting the food up there? Why aren't you eating it? Just eat, don't worry. I hate when they have more than one desperate need because then they just don't do any of them. You don't need to butt in here. You get hydrated or something. Somebody died. Toddlers don't have phones, all right. Then why is he getting the call? Robin is dead. Oh my goodness, another sibling. No, don't go to bed in the swimming pool. It sucks that you can't solve their needs just by clicking on the button. Because then they want to solve them in a very stupid way that doesn't solve a damn thing. Okay, you've got a tantrum here, Ridley. You have to go discipline. Elliot? 
Butt the hell out. Butt the hell out. Go take your own shower. Get away. I am dealing with these guys. And your mother has to discipline. Your boss. Hey. Okay. Go bring him to sleep. All right. I really, really, really wanted to age up the boys today. Let them get a little bit of sleep. He's got about half a part of thinking to fill up. Um, Forest is good, so as soon as Forest wakes up, we can huge him up. And then we have our new little Killian, who's just starting on everything, but at least he's got communication up there. Ridley, go eat something, because I'm sick of your bitching. Let's see, we'll make him a doctor, our son the doctor. Samantha reached motor skill 4, and she is good. She's got homework done. Let's go out. Ah. Ah. Narfa? Dravoy. <laughs> ah. <coughs> She's so full of herself sometimes. Oh. Um, and then- Oh! Romance Festival's in town! Is that what you're wearing? I thought you changed outfits. Okay, delayed reaction. Who can we find? There's no one here. Um, yeah, pink hair dude, okay. This is the lo loneliest romance festival I have ever seen. Why are you up in my apartment? We were supposed to be at the festival together. I have a feeling we have met our next baby daddy. Oh, Sean! Don't mind me, Sean. This is just how your mom rolls. I dig your pink hair, dude. Look, we're up to first kiss already. She's upset about this. I don't know why. Who are you? And two, is this handsome guy? Oh, he's a teen, but you know what? Maybe we can meet him. He'll, he'll grow up someday. They're very happy about that. You're a teen, huh? It's okay. You get older soon. I won't, but you will. I think we got our next baby daddy prime, though. What if the baby will come out with pink hair? She's like, just stop it now. <laughs> oh, he gave her a rose. Okay, who else can we meet? Wait, there is someone. Kenneth Brenner. <laughs> I know him. I made him. I don't think I had a baby with him. Throw some petals at him. <laughs> we can get baby daddy number next uh, one and next two and possibly next three, depending on how long that team's got to go before he ages up. Is this an awkward encounter? Oh, I'm so sorry. He's not the jealous type, it's okay. I just met him too. Not even a date. Jealous friend. Will you be my friend? There we go. Got another pink bar. Well, that was a successful night. There goes our son William. <laughs> Foster? No. Don't bother your sister, your food's right here. Donna? Why don't you go down to the romance festival? Pour some tea? And chat with people, okay? Just butt out when I'm trying to do things with the kids. There are times when you want Sims to do something and they freaking completely- Oh, oh, oh! They completely ignore you. 
And then there are times when you don't want their help, but they're butting in. Alright, he's ready to age up. We gotta get Forest ready. What happened? Oh, the Romance Festival is over. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. I'm so sorry, baby. I tried to get you to do something social, but... Get a job. Okay, Ridley, let's, uh... Let's age up a child. Okay, the cake is bad. We have a spare. Yes, an arm? <laughs> oh, okay. Why is there a half-naked man in our... laundry room? Who are you? Jack Scott? We don't have a son named Jack, do we? Oh, yeah, and Foster aged up. And he's erratic. And he's a social butterfly. Oh, he's adorable. I love the hair. Remember when she bought rewards to help her prevent her from being tired all the time and hungry all the time? Yeah, me too. At this point, I'm thinking of just buying the ones where you're never tired. Considering the one where you're not supposed to be tired a lot is not working for her. Nor is the one where you're not supposed to be hungry a lot. Oh good, he's at three. We can age him up. And it's time to age up Forrest. Nope, sorry, Winter. Just can't. Okay. He is neat. He is also a social butterfly. We've been getting a lot of social butterflies, even though I've been doing it for random. Oh, and he actually stayed with red hair! That helps her pick up guys. You wanna feel the baby? Okay, why? 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 Okay, we gotta get vacuums? Doesn't the maid take care of the stuff? See if the maid takes care of it tomorrow. Oh, okay. Who's this? Oh, it's Elliot. Okay, Elliot's home. Kenneth Branagh is here. Invite him in. Oh my god, it's really dirty in here. Oh, he's coming upstairs. Why don't you invite him to spend the night? Why are you buttoning, honey? Honey, mom's. Do you see how mom's, mom's dress? Mom's work. Go to bed. There you go. There you go. Now invite him to spend the night. Is he cool with that? All right. Oh, oh, oh. She's in labor. Oh, were they in the middle of it? Oh, she's doing it while she's in labor? And he's unlucky enough to have walked in on it. Oh no, he's just standing it. She's standing there. That's what you get for going to sleep in the hot tub, dude. I told you time and time again to go to sleep in a bed. Right, you know what, Ridley? Why don't we just not prolong this? Go have your baby, and then go get knocked up again. There we go. You can't make them at the same time you have them. You really have to do it in the other order. Okay, it's a baby boy, and the daddy was Malachi or something, so let's name him... How about Marshall? Marshall Scott. There we go. You don't need your mommy, your sister was gonna help you, remember? Wait a second. You were supposed to be potty training him. Did he learn potty training? No. So, in other words, y'all just freaking ignored me. Feeling better, Ridley? Yes, Proud. Proud of herself. Well, I suppose when you give birth to your 45th baby and you still look that good, you have a right to be proud. 
So let's wrap this up here. We'll call it a day. I really appreciate you being here with me and watching this with me and enjoying this game with me. Don't forget to like or subscribe if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to check out my articles on Hub Pages published on Level Skip because you get to read them for free. You get to share them for free. You don't even have to sign up for anything. But they pay me when you do look at them. And they pay me when you send them to your friends to look at them. And then I get a little extra side cash at the end of the month. And I get to put a little extra food on the family table. And it's helpful. So don't forget to check them out in the link box below. Thanks again. And everybody have a wonderful day. Happy simming. And I'll see you next time.